Please, Thank you everybody else for coming out this morning. Speaking host members, members of the American Legion, close 25, family and friends. Welcome to today's ceremony and thank you for attending. I'm honored to be chief of a department that never forgets the service given by those who have gone before us. The Greek philosopher Thesudius once said, the bravest are surely those who have the clearest vision of what is before them, glory and danger alike, and yet notwithstanding, go out to meet it. We're here today to honor our departed members, to remember their achievements, their courage, their dedication, and to say thank you for their sacrifices. Thinking of the heroes who join us in the group today, and those who are here only in spirit, person can't help but feel awed by the enormity of what we encounter. We stand in the midst of patriots and the family and friends of those who have nobly served. The Beacon Hose Company members and service members we honor today came from all walks of life, but they shared several fundamental qualities. They possess courage, pride, determination, selflessness, dedication to duty, and integrity, and all of the qualities needed to serve a cause larger than oneself. All of our volunteers join for many different reasons. Not all members want to fight fires. However, they're calling to community and service or to be part of something bigger than themselves. Our members and American service members were ordinary people who responded in extraordinary ways in extreme times. They rose to the call because they wanted to protect their community and a nation which has given them and us so much. As we depart today and enjoy time with our families and friends, always remember the sacrifices of our departed members and service members. They are the thread that creates the fabric of our great organization, our community, and our nation. Thank you for being part of this ceremony. God bless you, God bless Beacon Hose Company, and God bless the United States of America.